This kid is a gamer. He's a follower. He's a slave maker and a shot caller. Episode 10, lads, and look at that. 21 games, 44 points, one point ahead. We're top of the division. We're on course for the Premier League. And I, for one, can't be happier. I thought I'd be mid-table, probably. Nearer to the playoffs, because I'm just simming games. Picking the team, picking the formation now and again, changing it up. But uh, lately, I've just been going all up attack and again, hoping for the best, and it's been paying off. McPhail still wants to leave. Departure imminent, so he can go. He's he's been doing my boxing all uh, all season. He have. There's only um I think it's a month left of the transfer window. Where he's going to be the first run up, along with Helgerson. And then I'm going to invest in the, um a couple of youth players. Hopefully, if I can find some, I'll check our website, see if it does work. See if we do go up. Hopefully, I get get a nice bargain. Wouldn't be too bad, would it? We start building for the future then, for life in the Premier League, if I do get up here. David Marshall, take a look at my contract. I'll have a look, because he's, he's my number one keeper. He plays well, he's been doing well lately. Let's have a look. Offered him a contract, yeah. 22 appearances, 7 clean sheets, he's my number one keeper. I give him all my wage budget, 8.2k there. And the greedy bugger didn't even accept it, look at that. Greedy eyes. If he wants to play our ball, he can uh, sweat out a bit. See what happens in January. First game there is against Forest. Hopefully, don't want to repeat the Saturday in real life where we lost 3 1 away to him. And see if like, we do away games in real life. Malachi Mackay, I've got the balls, I go attack. And it pays off there. Maynard on the 11th minute gets one in for me. He's been brilliant. Kimbo Young, my, my Korean star, he gets an injury. They, oh, I get a player sent off. That's not good. But I get a goal in a 50... What's that, 50 second? Connolly, my uh, defender. He gets one in. Yellow card. Jordan Much gets one on the 80th. And that's a 3-0 away win with 10 men. That's a yes. And from Barca is going to be suspended for... Is it one game? Yeah, only one game. Kimbo Young's up for uh, three days. What's he got? Bruised tailbone. Never heard of that one, but... That's what my physio says. But, um... Get straight into the next game, yeah? Charlton at home. Could be a tricky one. They've got an injury. But uh, I've got that injury and suspension. Kimbo Young's quite good for me. Oh, he's actually playing, yeah? Couldn't be now injured with his tailbone. Yeah, attack. I know I've got the players who can score. i got Ernie with pace. There he is in the 23rd, popping a goal in. Uh, yellow for them. They get put in score 30 of Jackson, but my boy Maynard, he pops one in. Right, Phillips comes on for Cowie. Much comes on for Balmy. Ernie gets another one on there. What's that, 66 minute? So, yeah, both my strikers are doing pretty well. 3 1 home win, I'll have that. And all that's six goals the last two games, so they're doing something right. Don Cowie worried that he had plans to replace him, but no, he done well there. And then on to our last and final game of this episode. Cardiff against Huddersfield. Another away game. McNaughton gets one straight away in the first minute. Must have been some attacking move there. They get a yellow. Bellamy picks up a yellow. A standard for Bellamy. Probably arguing with the ref knowing him. 45th minute half time. Much comes on for Kimbo. Bellamy pops in a pen on the 48th. Much picks up a yellow. Maynard again. He just keeps scoring that boy. 66 minutes that was. Turn it on Hudson. They get red, but that is a 3 0 away win, and that is math as a happy chappy. No, so that's awesome. I'll check the stats and everything, put them on the next video. See how many I have actually won in a row. And that's it for today, boys. Cheers for watching, and ta da!